Uh, Salona is very nice because it's it's a uh, it's a great place to meet, um, meet your contacts, and, yeah, see what's happening, and then get home and then sort out okay what was the really nice things to see and what was not. So for the um, Salona this year, I'm showing one thing is the Beulet 12 from BNDO Play. It was just launched in uh, February and now it's uh, shown here in Milan. And then another thing is the chair I'm sitting in, minuscule for Fritansen. And the third thing is uh, I'm, I'm curating an exhibition in uh, Lambrate. It's uh, called Minecraft 12 from uh, Danish Craft. It was a very nice collaboration and they gave me a brief, portable sound. And then, of course, there's a lot of technical details I didn't know anything about. But it's, I didn't see it as a problem, but more as a great now I need to, to get some more knowledge. So it was very nice um, going there, looking into details, um, yeah, investigating. Yeah, it's, uh, the, the brief was a portable sound, so actually a very basic sound that you can bring with you. Uh, so this is also why it looks as it, as it does. So it has a handle for one thing, very obvious. Okay, this one you can carry around. Um, it has airplay, so you can have your, your phone in the pocket and then play music, stream it. And then we, we were using the, the, uh, the best virtues of the B&O. Uh, they are very good at doing aluminum work, aluminum, um, and then combined with plastic. Uh, which is a strong and durable material. So it has a very great sound um, and again the, the design of it uh, was quite, quite important that um, the speaker, speakers needed uh, a volume inside um, so it has a great sound compared to the size it has. Um, yeah and then the functionality it doesn't carry too many buttons and in, in the top it's uh, on off and up and down the volume, and then the, the airplay. So it's only like four buttons to, to press. I only know the Danish, Danish price, but it's a 5,500 Danish crowns. Anyway, it's a, it's a very nice price, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, the Red Dot Award, it's of course always nice to, to be applauded. So I'm of course very honored, and I think b and is the same. <laughs> Yeah, it was a, also a very nice collaboration with Fritz Hansen, uh, with the minuscule chair. Um, yeah, we were starting up, uh, starting up, uh, looking into the meeting situation, and then we did this uh, collection of chair and a table, where you can create different landscapes for the in-between meetings. That was uh, the main idea. No, yeah, the the minuscule chair is uh, made of uh, the the leg frame is uh, plastic. Um, so I had freedom in, uh, to shape it how I wanted, and the shell, it's, um, yeah, it's upholstery with a nice uh, quadrat fabric. And then we have the leather edge, which is quite important. It's like a contour all around the chair. Yeah, these two vitrines is uh, showing the, the process of uh, making of the minuscule chair. Showing, yeah, from starting with the sketching on paper, then to model work with papers and cardboards and very basic materials actually. And then all the steps further, uh, yeah, with the plaster and um, yeah, taking it off and putting more on. So this is the whole process. And then some tryouts and then the colors, the final colors. And over here you see how it's actually made and everything is sewn by hand. I started uh, studying in Copenhagen and I've always been like uh, fascinated by objects and uh, how things are made, how every, turning everything upside down, how is this detail made, how is this detail made, and the, yeah, the materials, if it's soft, if it's hard, the texture, etc. 
So it was a natural thing for me to study industrial design and furniture design. I, I, I'm not working too much with the word trend because I think it's more like looking at what you are actually needing to do and do as little as possible actually. My main point is to, to minimize and make it very simple. simple, just as simple as possible, but still keeping a, a spirit. I guess we are more focused on what uh, signals design is, uh, is giving and how it looks. A bit, maybe a bit too much, because it all comes to functionality in the end. Does it work or does it not work? Yeah.